Stop teasing, Tosh. Get on the ground. Tease him now! Ever met those tough guys who talk big until they're faced with real consequences? Well, get ready for a reality check. Here are the six cases where these fake tough guys get scared and make weak excuses when they have to deal with the law. Imagine driving down US Highway 1 in Flagler County, Florida on a routine patrol when suddenly you spot a familiar face, 26-year-old Raymond Glass, walking alongside a 30-year-old woman who has an active no-contact order against him. As Sergeant Weaver pulls over and approaches the pair, Glass starts to pick up his pace, clearly trying to avoid confrontation. But Sergeant Weaver isn't about to let this slide. Come here. <coughs> Raymond, come here. Well, thankfully, it was all captured on body cam, where Raymond Glass tried hard to avoid getting caught by the police. And things got intense fast when he didn't go quiet. He argued, resisted, and even hit the police car, causing a dent in the vehicle. What are you walking away for? I'm actually I know. Why am I being Because you're on probation. Yes. And you're, one of your conditions is you can't be near her. I'm not anywhere near her. I was, I was right in front of Stop her. Stop it, my man. Sir, I was right in front of her. Who's your PO? I don't know yet. I ha what I do you mean you don't I know? I have my first appointment tomorrow. Tomorrow? Yes. But you signed the paperwork. I'm not technically not near her. I wasn't talking to her. I wasn't doing anything. Bro, you guys were no walking contact. side by side I had no on contact. US 1. All right, come over here. Let Sir, me see if I can call your PO. Right. That's not right. Are you I in handcuffs? No, but still, you're just going to try to arrest me now? But no, right there in front of my car. Over here. No, you're going to try to arrest me now. For what? I got to call your PO and see if they, you're allowed to be around her. No, I'm not. A, you know I'm not allowed around her, but I, I, I wasn't even looking at you her. You guys were walking her, side by side on US-1. Did you see me talking to her, though? doesn't no, matter. That's you not can't contact. No. Stop it. That is not contact. If I'm sitting here walking, Stop that's not it. contact. No, not here. You went in front of her. Back there, you if guys were side by her, side. I still never talked to her. Okay, just relax. Sure, no, Let me call you. Right. No, Who's your PO? You guys are gonna arrest me. I don't know who my PO is. Well, I'm gonna pull the paperwork and see. No, you're gonna see, but you're gonna go and arrest me. I'm gonna call the them and see. All I was doing, I was walking right in front. No, you're walking As side you by side. Me over, I was walking right. Well, in front. yeah, but when how I you, first you saw you, you're walking you guys side by side. Arrest me. I was not talking to her. I did You can't have any contact with her. There was no contact. You're walking side by side with her, bro. Okay, passing her. No, not yes, passing I her. I passed her. On US Let me 1. see the camera footage then. All right. Well, from the very start of this encounter, it was clear that Glass wasn't going to see eye to eye with the officer. As expected, things quickly escalated as Glass dug in his heels, insisting he wasn't breaking any rules despite the officer's warnings. It's a case of stubbornness meeting authority, and it's not long before the officer has no choice but to bring out the taser. Put your hands Please, on your back. No, see, you can't arrest me. You can't Put arrest me. Put your hands on your back. Don't resist. How are you going to arrest me? Don't resist. How can you arrest me? Don't resist. Oh, you gotta ask me. No, Don't you resist. No, sir. How put your you hands behind me? your back. How can you arrest me? Put no, your hands no, behind no, your back. I didn't do Raymond, wrong. put your hands behind your back. No, it's not resisting. How are you guys arresting me? One ten. This is not. How are you guys arresting me? Put your hands behind your back. No, how are you guys arresting me? Raymond. Are you guys arresting me? Put your hands how behind your back. No. Then would you let me go? I need a county unit as well. Let me go. I will be fine. Put your hands behind your back. Quit tensing up. I'm not tensing. Do it now. Okay, so I'm gonna, I'll call police brutality if you guys slam me to the ground. I'm not Put your arms behind your back. I'm not resisting. Please, don't slam them. Oh, please, brutality. You're going to get tased. Put your hands behind your back. Please, brutality. Put your hands behind your back. You can't tase me. Put your hands behind your back. Put your hands behind your back. Listen, Put your hands behind your back. I've been stabbed. You can't tase me. Put your hands behind your back. You cannot tase me. Do it now. Sir, you can't tase me. Put your hands behind your back. You can't tase me. I'll have a lawsuit. Put your hands behind your back. You can't tase me. Put your hands behind your back. Please, brutality. Camera. I've just been tased. I've just yeah. been tased. Police brutality. Camera. Now. Camera. I'm tased. Now. They just tased me. I've been stabbed. I was not resisting. He tripped yes, me. Sure. Put it on camera now, babe. I'm putting it on camera. Quick. Back now. up. Back Quickly. up. No. You can't do nothing. She can go ahead and videotape this. They just tased One me. One male secure. I am on. Fuck that. I've been stabbed a few years ago. Taser I report. have trauma. 
They tased me and they tripped me. I was not being resistant. Police brutality, I have a lawsuit. Officer, can I get my wallet? No, if it's on him, no. Give, no, give her her no. wallet. Staying on I you. I will kick you with my foot. Give me her You're not wallet. gonna kick anyone. Give me her wallet. No, if it's on you, it goes to Joey. Give me my wallet. You're under arrest. Give no. you your wallet, we will. Give me my wallet. Yeah, your wallet will go with you. her. No, it doesn't work like that. No, you have to give her what I no, tell No, I don't. You. Okay, good. So now I can go ahead and sit there and uh, have another lawsuit. Go ahead. Tease me again, Don't tense Tease up me on again. me. Tease me Don't tense again. up on me. Tease me again, I will kick you in your Tease me again, I dare you. After Glass got tased once, he didn't back down. He kept pushing the officer, almost daring him to take further action. It was a tense standoff as Glass continued to challenge the officer, even threatening violence. But the officer maintained his composure, showing remarkable patience despite Glass's provocative behavior. When handcuffs weren't enough, they had to tie his legs, too. Keep watching to see how it all unfolded. I was not being resistant! And he still got a gun on my back. It's not a gun, it's a taser. It's still a form of a gun, you No, it's a taser. You didn't even get tased, you got drive-stuck. you guys see this, you got go ahead stuck. and file this lawsuit. Does he go into jail? Yes, he's under arrest. I'm under arrest for what? Violation of your probation. Oh, yeah? Resisting arrest. Oh, yeah? Well, for what, you stupid for? cracker? For what, you stupid yeah. cracker? How long is he going to be in there? It don't matter how it's long he's going to be in there for. Matter. Because I'm going to have a lawsuit on this stupid yeah. What's your name and your badge Sergeant number? Sergeant Weaver, you know nope, me. write that down, you I was the one who saved your life when your, you guts, were my life. your guts were hanging out of you. Maybe you, when you didn't you got save stabbed. my life. You was one of the people that posted and talked, you stupid cracker. Remember when you got stabbed and your guts no. were hanging out? Yeah, you that was me. That, that was you. me who pushed them Keep back. Keep talking about that. Don't kill me. PTSD! PTSD! Bring it back past <laughs> memories! PTSD! No, back up. Don't, Don't put tell my daughter here. back up. Everything goes She's with videotaping him. all your shit, cracker. She's videotaping all your shit. Everything goes tell with Tell her to back yes. up. This shit getting posted on Facebook, too. Make your shit look like shit. You got some change and stuff there, too, so I get into. Yeah, you better right. give that change to her. Nope, goes with you. No, because you're not putting that in the fucking jail. I worked hard for what I got. Don't fucking do that. Get me out. Get me in that f***ing car and do your f***ing job. Car just pulled up. I don't give a f*** about your stupid car. You Move just sat, before I you elbow just, you in your You just asked to get the car, didn't you? Move before I elbow you in your Don't. Why are you going to catch a battery LEO? I don't Raymond? give a f because you f***ing tased me for no f***ing reason. Uh, I didn't tase you for no reason. You yeah, you did. Yeah. I, I was not resisting and you f***ing tased me. On. I was not resisting and you f***ing tased me. Yeah, you were. No, I was not resisting. Everything is on camera, and, Raymond. All right, then I want to see that Camera footage because I was not. It's right here, don't worry. I was not fighting you guys. You guys tripped me. I did nothing wrong. Yep. You guys cannot arrest me for sitting there saying something. You guys can't just pull up on me for no reason at all. When it's part of your probation, then you can't Guess be around what? her. Then yes, you should it be is. arresting her too because we both have one against each other, you stupid. Oh. F if oh. you knew what it really was, you're a. Oh. Well, she can go to jail too then. Thanks for telling us. Apparently, she might have one too, so maybe she needs to go to jail also. See, just look, you guys really think you guys are gonna keep us apart? You guys are gonna keep. Hey, I'm not the jail. one that agreed to probation. You, know, you guys like are you gonna had... keep putting me in jail. Guess what? I'm still going back yeah. to this fucking woman, regardless. You're also gonna go to jail for threatening a law enforcement officer by saying you're gonna kill me. Oh yeah. Yep. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Wait, stop. Then I guess I should go ahead and do something to actually get. Then I should do something to actually give you a reason to put a charge on me, huh? Huh? Come on. Huh? Huh? Come on. What? What's up then? Huh? What's up? Ray. Pull your taser now. Huh? Pull your taser now. Raymond. Pull you your guys taser pull now. Back? Yeah. Pull your taser now. Do you want him in my car? Yeah. Yeah, pull I don't your taser now so I can kick you. Give you a What you gonna do? Slam me. Slam me. Pull. You did that, not us. Yeah. Come on. Come on. Come on. What? I'm a crazy no, white boy. Man. You think I care? No. no. Get your nuts off my hands. Stop. Just stop. In disrespect. Just Get your stop. hand off me. I'll bite you. Just shut up. Just shut up. Stop. Stop.
Let me grab a spit mask. Imagine the level of audacity this man has. What would you do with such a rigid suspect? It's extremely annoying. He even hit his head on the car, causing a dent. Is he really in his senses? He is being extremely disrespectful himself, claiming the officers are sexually assaulting him. It's quite astonishing, isn't it? Well, soon enough, the officer puts a spit mask on him and ties his legs. Just wait a sec. Okay. Oh, what, you're putting a bag over my head now? Uh, it's just a spit it's guard. It's a spit guard, so you don't spit on us, Raymond. What the f I'm gonna spit on you for? You guys are f stupid. I like to do prone. I can't get in there from here. Oh, well, why? Because you don't want people to see Raymond Matthew Glass 71494. That is my identity. That's why they put this shit on my face. Put it on the media. But now, police, police brutality, Whoa. not resisting. By, By the way, or, that point will be also put into evidence when I go to trial against you guys. Whoa, whoa. Her phone will be put into evidence in the video <laughs> against y'all. Don't worry, Raymond. We all have video, too. Are you Alpha, okay. Bravo, India, November, you guys are all female. Okay. You guys got the media here now too. Y'all. Who's the media? Oh, it has this many cops just for you guys to go and take care of one individual. Well, you're oh, not. Oh, wonderful. Not cooperate. That shows how you are, man. Okay, Remy. Learn to fight your little one-on-one -on -one battles yourselves. Okay. And you're gonna go ahead and try to get me for threatening. Oh, okay. what to do? I threatened an officer. So f***ing what? That's against the law. Yeah, guess what? It's not a felony either. It's a misdemeanor. Okay. Resisting arrest with violence is a felony. Uh, guess what? Yeah, where's the violence? Because I didn't swing on you or nothing. You don't have to. Nope, that's still violence. No. Nope. Violence is what you guys were doing, no. not me. You don't have to. Nope, you guys did the violence. So you want to go ahead and put me on a resisting arrest with violence? Could be my guess. I'll beat it. Can you run her and be benchmark? I think she's on probation and she can't be around him either. Yeah. Oh, I'm just all there. I have every right to look at your car number so I can go here and get you guys. No, try not to choke you with your handkerchief. Cutting it? I'm going to fuck out your mother. Around your neck. We're not going to. Doesn't matter, you cut it. You can't kick me. Now you kick me. No, I didn't kick you. You You can't. All right, where's the proof? Cause I went right here. Nope. How did I Stop. kick you? Now, you're up, now you, you got a battery no, Leo, nope, Raymond. No, nope, no, nope, no, Cause I didn't I kick you. Three people. Saying I did not <laughs> kick you. That was not three. I did not kick you. No. Nope. This now you stopped, got a and that was a chain. That was not me. Now you I got a battery it. Leo, Raymond. You did not. You're, see now you're lying because no, you kicked forward. You kicked forward. Right, your leg went back. Number two, cause I'm gonna get your in court too. I'm getting all you in court. Can't wait. 357. Like the I'm getting all you in court. Can't wait, Raymond. Nope, I'm getting all you in court because I'm beating it all. Watch. Hey, he also. Get off Commander. The f Shane. Hey, so now. Commander. Shut up for what? Commander. Shut up. Hey, he also headbutted the car and dented it. He also dented the car. So you got a neck shackle too? Because I'll headbutt you. Just make it. Don't kick me again. That's all. I'm standing on the chain. No. Because I didn't even see him. Yeah. Yeah. Dented it with his forehead. Where's the dent? I don't know. I don't see a dent. Right in front of your no face. Dent in my car. There is no dent. The sheriff there is just no dent. This too. There is Brand no. One. You did that. You. He slammed my head there. Okay. You did that. Camera, Raymond. No, it's on camera that he pushed my head there. The police had had enough. They proceeded to put him in the car, but not before asking if he had any injuries. Despite their concern, he remained extremely rude, blaming all the officers and still claiming they had used force on him when he had done nothing wrong. He's in my release for a battery. You stupid you're on no, inmate release what? for better You shouldn't alone. even be worrying about me you for this. Again? You want me arrest You shouldn't her? even worry about me with this battery on a law enforcement that you so-called that I so-called oh, okay. did to you. Okay, you Raymond, do you have any my woman. Raymond, do you have any injuries that the ambulance needs to check out? Yeah, definitely from you. Okay. Wait, what injury? You, from getting sure, drive stunned? From getting tased and from you tripping me. Okay. What's the injury? What's the injury? What's no, the you complaint? Kiss my no, no. Harry, do you want to get no, seen by them? No, you sit there and try to act like you helping me. You ain't trying to help you. I don't want none of y'all services. Y'all can go f yourselves. I hope y'all get corona. Die. It's not us. It's, it's okay. fire. Right I don't give a I hope they die too. You don't want to see him? No. Okay. You said no. Okay. I didn't say no. You just but guess did. What? But guess you what? You just said you don't want you any services. You can die from corona too, you f 
Peggy. Thank you, guys. Thank you, guys. Elbow. Did you just hit me again? Oh, so you're going to call it a hit again? That wasn't a hit. Yeah, nice sure. try, you f***ing faggot. All right, you know what? I know you was lying about the first one. Raymond, are you going to let us check your pockets before we get to no. the car? Huh? You going to put me on the ground again? Good, because I'll go ahead and have more f***ing I'll put you on the ground if you don't let us search you. I'll make sure I slam my face so hard. Okay, are you going to let us check your pockets before we put you in the car? No, That's like a no? To, I'd like to do a standing up so we don't no. have to go down to the ground. Okay, do you want to go on the ground and do it, or standing up? Do you want to go ahead and put me to the ground? Have, feel free. I mean, we will you if want, we have you guys to, but you have to be searched. Because obviously, okay. you guys like roughing me up. Okay, you have to you be searched. You guys like with the Glass family. So okay, you know right. what? You can go yourself. Put okay. me on the ground. I dare you. Okay. Oh, I saved your life a few years ago, so I don't like you. Save I mean, you're in touch. big bro, John, saved me because no. he called you guys. You yeah. guys didn't save I was the one pushing your organs back inside you of you. You weren't the one pushing my organs. It was another mm. buddy of mine, and that was Jamie. No, it was Nice me. try. Can you let me check all your pockets standing up? I don't. I just like to... I know. I know. Saved saved my life. Pushing Stop lying to me. In. You okay. didn't save my First one there, Raymond. You were not the first one Yes, there. I was. The ambulance was there way before you. No. Yes, it was. I was there within 10 seconds no, of the call were. coming out. Okay. You were not. Okay, Raymond. Are you going to let us check your pockets or no? So we can speed up the process? F*** your speed up. You guys ain't gonna get it without a hassle. Right, you already trying to, you guys are bit. already trying to hit just me a with a f***ing battery on a Leo. Just a little so bit. guess what? No, f*** you. Okay. Cause I didn't even kick this Yeah, you did. No, I didn't. Okay. Go ahead and kick me with it then. Whatever. You are getting You hit guys just wanna do it. Yeah, you ain't hurting. Stop lying. You don't have to hurt. I never even touched you. And I hope that was on the camera it was on and everything the entire else. Time. If it the was not time. on camera, guess what? You're gonna sue me? Yeah, I'm definitely suing. I'm okay. suing so I know you said that about And, and see you wanna bring up my past. You're lucky I don't fing headbutt you in your right now. Um, okay, okay, right. With my PTSD. Finally, the time came, and officers put him in the patrol car. Yet the task proved equally challenging, fraught with tension and difficulty. Check it out. Okay, Raymond. Knock your off. Come on. You going on this side? Knock your shit off. Stop right there. Stop, Raymond. Don't pull that out. It looks like she took probation, so she's currently on probation, and the particular probation says she can't use intoxicant system. Okay. I know his has the thing where he can't have any contact with her. Yeah, so she had those charges, and she's already put out to, like, probation. So did he. She's on phone. But there's, she has nothing, no contact wise? Raymond, come on, get in the car. Police brutality! Stop police brutality! Police brutality! Stand up and get me and hurt me! They pulled okay. me by my feet and dropped me! Get in there. They're throwing me in! Police brutality! Police brutality! Police brutality! Move your head! Move your head! Police! He kicked me in my head! Police brutality! Police brutality! Police brutality! Police brutality! He's beating me in my head! Police brutality! Pick your head up! Easy, nice and slow. Nice and slow. You see the dent right there on the where he hit his head? There might be two of them. I know he hit it twice. The second time I think he hit more of the glass. Right here, you see it? Right here? Yep, that was that first one we were walking. Oh, that was the one? Raymond Glass was transported to the Sheriff Perry Hall inmate detention facility and formally charged with a litany of offenses, including battery on a law enforcement officer, assault on a law enforcement officer, threats to a law enforcement officer, criminal mischief exceeding $1,000, possession of drug paraphernalia, and two counts of resisting arrest. In addition to these charges, he faced the serious allegation of violation of probation for breaching a court-ordered no-contact directive. Given the severity of the charges and the violation of probation, authorities deemed it necessary to detain Glass without the option of bond. Well, if you think this guy was really tough to handle, you haven't met this man. On February 13, 2023, detectives of Blue Ash Police Department, Ohio, had an intense encounter. It all started with a routine patrol when officers spotted a speeding red Subaru. But what seemed like a simple traffic stop quickly turned intense after officers found a man, Raymond Tambower, with a fake ID and a dark past. Despite officers' attempts, Tambower resisted arrest, leading to a dramatic showdown. You mind rolling this window down? Yeah, I just don't 
walk, like walking yeah. past uh, windows yeah, or whatever. Going. You guys have a dangerous job. Yeah, I'm Officer Bowman with Blue Ash Police. The reason I pulled you over because you were going a bit, a bit quick. You know what the the speed limit is on here? I'll be honest with you, I just go when I'm over here. Yeah, it's 45. Okay. And you were going closer to 60. <laughs> okay. You're yeah. good. Yeah, you got your license and yep. ID. Yep. All right, you have your ID on you. Where are you guys headed? Uh, back to Fort Wayne. Oh, is that where you're from? Yeah. All right. What are you doing all the way over here? Picking him up. Oh, yeah. okay. There's <laughs> like some Burger Snake place. Oh, yeah. Birch Hill Sweets yeah. now? Yeah. yeah. Really. All right. I'll be right back with you. All right. As long as you don't have some like crazy freaking history and all that, I'll just let you go. All right. As the officer approached the car, her eyes were immediately drawn to the man in the back, who seemed to be hiding something in a mysterious backpack beside him. The officer's suspicions intensified when she discovered that the social security numbers provided by the suspect were completely off the mark. Things got really intense when the officer went back to investigate and asked the suspect to step out of the car. Hey, ma'am. Raymond. Raymond what? Do you have a date of birth? You wouldn't happen to be uh, lying about who you are, right? You don't have warrants or anything like that? Hey, get him out of the car until we can verify it. Raymond, step out. What are you doing, man? Get out of the car! I'm, just, I'm literally strapped. Yeah. I don't know what you're you reaching for, You were turning your dude. back on us, man. I don't know what you're reaching for. Literally for the okay. seatbelt, that's... Yeah. Come on, man. What are you reaching for? Man, nothing. Literally for nothing. Oh, Alright, man, we're getting you. Alright, well let us just get out of the car, man. What are you doing? Look, for for one, you guys just snatched me up with a kind of brain surgery thing going on. Listen, okay. Look, okay, listen. you need to come out of the car. Right. So he turned his whole back towards us, okay? okay. I have a I'll reach across and get it off. Strapping me out, yanking me Hold out. Hold on, man. Stop pulling from me. That's what I'm getting pulled from. Yeah, I'm man. getting pulled from. That was literally the seat. Right. It's not even on. It, it was right. on. Right. Right. It was right. on. You guys right. just literally right. pulled right. it off me. Put Listen, your arm, I just don't want you reaching up. for your backpack. Lift your arm up. Lift your arm up. Lift your arm up. Hold on. I can, now put your can, arm through can there. Can I allow myself to get out without being stripped up, wrapped up, tangled up in a Guys, come on, man. Step out of the car, please. Go ahead and start us another car. Stop Step reaching for hole. stuff. I'm going with two. Stop reaching for things. Can I? Can I? No. Stop reaching for things. We've asked you multiple times. Stop reaching. Hey, he's got. He's putting something behind his keep. Guys, come on. Get on the radio. We're fighting with one. Keep your hands up. Fight with one. Fight with one. Get out of the car. Do not drive, dude. I got you identified. Do not drive. Okay. I can't drive, but I have it. Get off. I got the wrong. Hey, you guys get off! Me? 75, we need help. Come on, man. Get off! Undo his hand, man! What are you doing, dude? Put your Stop hand... Stop resisting! Stop it! Put your hand behind your back! Stop oh, racing for... I'm not. I have nothing on me. But I have a brain condition. Put your hand Fine. behind your back! Fine. Well, I got a... Fight with one. We need Whoa. help. I got a brain condition. You're choking me. I can't... Breathe. Down on the ground! Put your chest on the ground! Ow. Put your chest on the ground! Stop, dude! Stay in the car! Guys, stay in the car, hands up! Do not move! Guys, I'm down! Put your hands behind your back! Please stop choking me! Please stop choking me! Do not move! Keep your hands on the desk! Up on the roof! Up on the roof! Right. Yeah, we got him. Let me know. We got him. I'm ready to go. Hands behind your back. Hands behind your back. I wasn't reaching. <laughs> guys, bro, you literally just kicked me out on the seat belt, man. What are you doing? Sit down. Thanks for cooperating. Thank you. Go ahead and cuff her. Just yes, for a second. Can you please turn your car off? Yes, ma'am. I got her. Oh my God. You got her? Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, just, <laughs> just cut. Uh, you might cough in him. Yep, yep, yep. After facing strong resistance from the prime suspect, the officers managed to bring the situation under control with the help of backup. However, even after being handcuffed, the suspect's boldness was evident as he was still showing no signs of remorse on his face. Is your buddy or what? How you know? Uh, Dude, he's perfect. I 
I know I knew his sister and I know him and his girlfriend been going through a hard time. He said his motor blew up yesterday and he needed a ride to Fort Wayne. So I I be already up this way, so I figured I'd sweep him and take him back to Fort Wayne with us because that's where we live at. And I talked to his sister for a little bit, like I didn't know it was gonna be anything like this at all. So are you injured in any way? I feel like it. You feel like it? Well, I uh, seatbelt on. Okay. He goes and tells me to get out. Okay. I go to take the seatbelt off. He chokes me up, pulls me out by the seatbelt. I'm being choked. One of them punched me in the face for nothing. Like, I can't even breathe. I got a mouthful of dust. Uh, I got a broken collarbone. I asked if they can not help me up like this. I already have a scar at the back of my head from a brain surgery. Like, I'm asking them, like, can you guys not really just be so rough with me? I'm, I'm complying. I'm literally trying to get out. I have a seatbelt on. Is that my fault? Like, I don't think they should have pulled me out with a seatbelt. Literally choked. The seatbelt was around my neck and he's just pulling me. Hold me off, son. Okay, relax, relax. Relax so we don't get any more excited. How you doing, guys? Better. I'm sure. What happened? Uh, how Who was driving? Let me I was driving. You were driving. I was okay, driving. Cool. That your car? That's, it's my Registered car. Registered to you? Okay, right, okay, okay, cool. And I'm driving, uh, cop gets behind me, okay. so I pull over because right. Right on. why not? Yeah. Okay. And then as soon as we start pulling over, he started freaking out, saying he was going to run and <laughs> she's telling him not to, and then they approached the car. I guess he gave the wrong social or something. He gave his sister's social, she can't remember instead of his, and she yeah, came he back and asked her to get out of the okay. car, and they just went from yeah, there. Yeah, I asked him to get out of the car. Uh, he reached over to undo his seatbelt. The cop thought he was reaching, I guess, grabbed him, and then it just, he wouldn't, he just wouldn't like accept being arrested. Okay. In my last few arrests, I said I was compliant. I don't think there was any reason for me to get choked up the way I got choked up, right. slammed like right. I got slammed. I literally had a seatbelt on. He asked me to get out of the car. I'm trying to take my seatbelt off. He just wraps his, his arm around me, chokes me, pulls me, does this and that. Okay. That's just nuts, man. That's just, how does he just do that to me? I wasn't here for that, but I know, I'm, but I'm like, so I, can I, get I, I, think, I, so. think, I think my buddy's got a video of that because that's crazy. Raymond Tambor's explanations were of no use, as he was later charged with obstructing official business, resisting arrest, possession of drugs, and aggravated possession of drugs. His bond was set at $7,000. However, the court delayed proceedings on the charges of obstructing official business and resisting arrest. Just like Raymond, we have another man exhibiting the same traits, but with extreme audacity. On July 31st, 2023, it's a scorching hot day in Ada, Oklahoma, and you're just doing your shopping at Walmart when suddenly something grabs the attention of everyone in the parking lot. Yep, that's right. The cops are there dealing with this guy named Justin Glaspie who's causing a big scene. It all started with a call about a guy driving drunk. Glaspie, not wanting to play nice, decides to make a run for it. But when the cops catch up to him, he's like a stubborn mule, refusing to get out of his car. And when they try to talk him out of it, well, things get a bit rough. Punches are thrown, and it's total chaos. Oh, and guess what? It was all recorded. Check it out. We got a call you that was concerned about you, and we was just doing a welfare check on From you. From who? From who? What's that? From who? From who was it? Are you okay? No. What's going on? I'm fine. Okay. You say you're not okay? I'm fine. Thanks. Bye. Okay. Hey, hey, stop, 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 sir, stop. Well, just when the officer started interrogating him, he knew something was off, and now he's going to face consequences. So he instantly started the car and left the place as if the officers wouldn't be able to catch him. But soon, after a short distance, the officer caught him. Check it out. Step out of the car! Step out of the car! Turn your car off. What's up? Why did you pull away from me? Because I'm not being able to talk to you Step out here and Get talk to us. Get out of the car. 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 No. Get out of the car. Why? Because I told you to. That's not a reason. You got your baton on you? I do. You got your baton on you? No, I do not. What's up? Move. Get out of the car. Get out of the car. Bro. Bro. I'm not that guy. What? I'm not that guy. Get out of the car. I'm not Lindsay. I'm not any of that. What's your car? Get out of the car. Get out of the car. Get out of the car. Just tell me. Get out of the car. Get out of the car. Why? Because I told you to. 
Just tell me the reason why. Because I'm telling you to. That's not a lawful order. It is a lawful order. You're not. I'm not Lindsay. You're on a traffic stop. I'm not any of that. I didn't do anything that stopped or any of that. Leave me alone. Step out of the car. No. Step out of the car. There's no reason to. Because I told you to. I gave you a lawful order. That's not a lawful order. It is. Step For out of the what? car. You don't get out of the car. You're gonna For what? Out of the car. You don't even know who I am. Are you yes, you yes, Who am I? Get out of the car. Who am I? Okay. I mean, I've already dealt with that. With what? With the pepper ball. Yeah, I've dealt, dealt with the stun shield. I'm not the guy. Get out of the car. I work for child welfare. Well, we don't care. Get out you of the don't car. care. You open my door without. Get out of the car. For, for, you didn't open the my door with permission. I'm not that guy. We'll I'm not that guy, bro. We're gonna pepper, We're gonna pepper ball you. Okay. Let go of me. And I'll call Jason Mosley. I don't. I'll call Jason Mosley. I'll, I'll play these games, Get out dude. Of the car. Let There's go. no reason to. Get out of the car. It's a lawful order. Get out. That's not a lawful order. It is. What did I do that was wrong? You're intoxicated. From what? Get out of the car. Now. You're intoxicated. Okay, but you're playing all these games to I'm play not. these Get games. out of the car. Just talk to me. Get out of the car. Get out, get out of the car. Get out of the car. Just because talk I've told to me. you numerous times to get out of the car. Just talk to me. Okay. Okay. We're going to pepper ball you when we okay. get here. And I'll call Jason Mosley <laughs> and play, play these guys. Oh, he's going to play. Okay, good. Get out of the car. There's no reason to. Get out of the car. You're intoxicated. Get out of the car. I can smell it. Come from your breath. Get out of the car. Okay. And that's a assault on a police officer. How is that assault on a police officer? Because you just threw that at me. Because I'm being <laughs> assaulted. Yep. Because you're disobeying a lawful order. There's no reason to. Yeah, get out of the car. Okay, but you're trying to assault me. Put your hands up on that car. No. Put your hands, Put your no hands up on that car. To do that if you're gonna be like that. Out of the car. Okay, I'm now, not scared of that. Unlock it. It's unlocked. It's open. Take your seatbelt off. Get out of the car now. Don't reach for anything. Just get out. Get out. Well, again, one thing is clear. Like any typical case, he behaved similarly, denying any charges against him. But as soon as he got out of the car, the officers handcuffed him. But that was not an easy task. There's no Three, reason to two. be like this. Turn around. Get out. Put your hands behind your back. Bro, just stop. I'm not that guy. Get on the ground now. On the ground. On the ground. <laughs> Put your hands behind your back. Do it now. Hands behind your back. Do it now. Put your hands behind your back. Uh -huh. Put your hands behind hands your back. Hands behind your back. Do it now. I'm a child welfare specialist. I don't care what you are. Hands okay. behind your back. Okay. Drive center. Okay. Drive center. Okay. Get your hand. You have a baton? No. I'll pull it. Get your hands behind your back now. You want to assault me? Let's stand right there. Don't bite me. He just hit me. One hand secure. Give me your other hand, dude. Stop, stop the this and give him a hand. Apologize. Give your, give us your other hand, dude. Apologize for getting me. The hell is wrong with you, man? Because you're one. Who does that? We do when somebody doesn't do a low bail lawful order. Somebody for hitting somebody. That's not a reason. You're not gonna hurt me. I don't Roll told over. You. Tell Jason. Mosley Fine, you can lay on your stomach then. All right. Tell Jason, tell Jason Duncan. Oh, you're getting good. So many charges. Man. Good. Tell them. <coughs> tell them. I have my body cam too. Thanks you for breaking play my glasses. These <laughs> justly, I'll play them too. I'm yeah. not that guy. He's good. Just leave him there. Dude, quit trying to assault me. I'm not that guy. I done told you who the I was. Well, you have about three or four felony counts going on. You know? For what? Assault on. Officer. What did I do to assault you, Justly? You hit him and you hit what me. What did I do that assaulted him? What did I do? Because somebody starts hitting me and I don't also, allow him to do it? You also and you want to play this game? I don't care who you are. You don't? Okay. Well, then don't be calling a joint response. And well, after hitting the officer adding a battery charge, he was taken to the patrol car to be moved to the station. So he'll face the consequences of his actions. I can guarantee you you're not going to be Put underneath you. Okay. Put underneath you. Dude, I'm just, stand just, up. Bend, just yeah, put yeah. it in my wrist and I'll help you up. I'm going to get your arm. Okay. Just on my wrist. Stand up. Right. Right. Go on my wrist. Help, go, just help me up. You're going to help me. There's no reason to be. What it needs to be, and that's fine. 
Bro, hey, you're hey. not going to take hey. me down. Stop. Let's go. Got a seat. We had an advice. Are you going to get my shit? We're going to get it. Hey, go get it. Have get in there. I'm sitting I'll down. I need my shoe. My foot's we'll burning. Get, get in. Okay. I'm in here. Put your butt I on that chair. Shoe. Let's go. Get my shoe and I'll be We're going to get it. Bro, I'm telling bro. you how to help me. I'm not playing these games. Justin Glasby was arrested on suspicion of several serious charges, including driving under the influence, threatening an act of violence, assault and battery on a police officer, aggravated assault and battery on a police officer, resisting an officer, obstruction, and eluding an officer while endangering others. Currently, Glasby is being held without bond at the Pontotoc County Justice Center. Unlike any of those mentioned cases before, this man took things to the next level. Even after being tasered and sprayed, he managed to escape from the situation. On an October evening in Cedro Woolley, Washington, what appeared to be a routine check on a suspicious car parked outside a Burger King escalated into a tense standoff between law enforcement and a man determined to avoid capture. Despite repeated orders from the officers, the driver, identified as Garrett Richardson, refuses to cooperate because of some trouble he's in. Despite being sprayed and shocked, he persisted in his attempts to flee in the car, speeding through the streets. He was pursued by dogs and a drone. After a tiring two and a half hours, the police eventually located Richardson clinging to a log in a river. Yeah, you heard that right. But why did he suddenly stop and run into the woods? Hi there. I didn't get your first name. Uh, I don't want to give my name. I'm just sitting here. Okay, I'm just trying to have a conversation no, I know, with you. I know. Okay. So I mean, I'm just sitting here with my friend. I mean, all they do is like you drop someone off, sure. drop some pizza, mm -hmm. and then I'm just sitting there using a the phone and I'm getting hassled now. So you're getting hassled because this is a closed business and it's a suspicious but car. But there's no sign. And how's a suspicious car? It's a 2,000 keys. I think, I think that our officer mentioned there was a burglary here, so oh, really yeah, any yeah. car that's here when the business is not right. open, and that's her, her issue is that you're here too right. early, and she doesn't want suspicious cars that she doesn't right. recognize that are not employees to be here in the morning. Right. Now she's being gracious that she does not wish to trespass you. Well, yeah, I know. Okay. So does that mean can I go home? Uh, right now, hold on. Okay, I mean, we're making sure that you're, t you're telling us who you really are, okay? Well, I'm not telling you nothing. I mean, that's the thing. I, mean, I don't I don't I mean, I'm just getting ready to take off. I only got down to use the phone real fast. Okay, now... Using using I mean, Wi-Fi? No, right now, right now, right now, no, you're detained right now because we have reasonable suspicion for a suspicious vehicle. We're contacting you. You're in that car, okay? You're here at a at a business that is not open, and we got a legitimate call from an employee about you. Just because I'm sitting here? Yes, at a business that's closed. Like ten seconds. I mean, all they do is just use the phone. Okay. I mean, I don't know. I just yeah. So normally when people are weird about telling me who they are, well, they no, have it's warrants. Just because I just know my rights is all. I mean. Okay. You know. I mean. Okay. Is that what we're going to end up no, finding? No, I'm taking care of all my everything. Okay. Like, I just did. I. Sure. Back in. George. I went to jail May 31st. Got out from. June 23rd. Like I did all my time. I haven't had no pullovers, no court dates, okay. no nothing. Okay. Like, I haven't done anything. Okay. Well, the officer can be seen asking for Garrett's first name, but Garrett refuses to provide it, indicating that he does not want to disclose his identity. Despite the officer's attempts to engage in conversation and clarify the situation, Garrett remains reluctant to cooperate fully. He expresses frustration at being approached by the officers while simply sitting in the car with a friend and using his phone. No, well, I will ask before you leave today that you pick up your pizza crust, though, because I don't want you littering. Okay. okay. I will. Can I reach for a cigarette? Um, I would prefer you not to reach for stuff, okay? okay. Just, just while, while you're with me. It makes yeah. me nervous, okay? It's all right. Right. It's, for, it's for customers. Then why is it on all night? It's a good question. I mean, it's just like, just like people leaving their garbage cans out all night. People leave their garbage cans all night, out all night, and you can't throw your garbage in their garbage, right? They pay for it. Oh, yeah, I mean, I didn't plan anything like that. I mean... I'm just using their Wi-Fi real fast so that I can make a call to my mom. Sure, you get a hold of the jail or no pick. So I can be able to go there. Sure. It's 5 o'clock in the morning. Did the other officer mention that we do have audio video recorders? Yep. Okay. Just making sure. Are you living in your car right now? No, this is no. my mom's car. Okay. 
As time passed by, Garrett's frustration seemed to intensify. Soon, the officer requested him to step out of his car, revealing that they now had his arrest warrant. However, just as they made this declaration, things took an unexpected turn. You'll have to see it for yourself to believe how it unfolded. Did you see how freaked out that lady was? No. Okay. I mean, freaked out about what though? I mean, I was here like right before she even got here. I was just sitting here you talking on my phone the whole time. Mm -hmm. That's it. And she sat there and I was like looking over her, I was wondering, you know, like, I was kind of actually wondering, like, go ahead. Right, go ahead and step out of the car. Yeah. And then and take take your seatbelt off. You have a, a a warrant for arrest right now. Warrant for what? Mm -hmm. So take you your, your seatbelt off. Warrant okay. out of Burlington for driving suspended. You have a felony. Okay. Okay. Hold on. Okay. Can I please no. a felony warrant? No. What? No, you can take your seatbelt hey, off. Okay. okay. Can you please take hold on a off. second, dude? I don't. No. I'm starting to get anxiety. I don't take, want you to do take this. Your off, please okay. don't touch okay. me, Derek. Ma'am. Please off. don't touch me. Then take your seatbelt. Don't. Take your seatbelt. No, off right don't. I want another unit here. Don't grab for it. I want another unit here, please. So stop touching you. You. My name is not. Harry, dude. Okay. They, sh they sent me your department of licensing photo. Dude, okay. I'm Bryce Casera. Then show me okay. some ID. I told you I don't have it. Okay, okay. take your seatbelt off. Dude, can you please hold on a second? Please call for another unit. I don't like what you want. I want another unit. Please, I want another unit. We're the only two on. Come can on. you please give me another unit? No, there's nobody else take on. Just when the officer realized that Garrett wasn't going to cooperate, they were bound to use pepper spray and a taser on him. However, what was truly shocking was that even after the deployment of the taser and pepper spray, Garrett still managed to escape from the situation. Check his guts. Dude, stop it! Come on! Get out of the car now! Hey, what are you doing? What are you doing? You're under arrest Get right off now. Of me. You're under arrest. Garrett, you're under Help! arrest. Get out of the car. Help! Help! Dude, please stop! Okay. Do you want to do this? Please stop! Do you now. Please use my phone no, so I can call now. my mother about her no. car. No. Get out please. of the car now. Sir, please, I'm not going nowhere. Come on, dude. Please. Come on, man. Garrett, get out of please, the car. Dude. Come on, I didn't do nothing. Phone. Do you want out to of the can car I now. Just use my phone. No. Sir. Drop the keys. No. Sir, can I please just use no. my phone? No. Drop the keys. Why? You're going to get sprayed. Okay, okay dude. Drop the keys. Drop the okay, keys. Okay, dude. Please stop. I'm not going to tell you again. Please. I'm out of the car. Step out right now. Get out of the car. Okay. Step out. Please stop. Step out right now. Okay, please. Get out. Stand up. Look at my arm, dude. Look at my arm. Look. 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 I've had surgery. Dude, I've had surgery. Okay, please. Step out. This intense encounter, pepper spray and taser, and he still managed to flee from the situation. It's just awful. Two and a half hours after it all began, the tracking officers heard shouting west of their location as the drone located Richardson, who was unable to swim, clinging to a log in the river. Can you even imagine? So he started to, tried to start his car, and uh, he ended up getting pepper sprayed. And then when he was get he got tased, and right at yeah, right at that time I went to the other side and tried to pull the key out of the ignition because I, I could tell what he was trying to do. And uh, he I don't know what he did. He skinned my my hand, which just got dirt in it now. But skinned my hand. Yeah, or pulled the key out of my hand. I don't know because my fingertips are numb too. And then my yeah. The palm of my left hand kills right now. And I don't know. I have no idea how that happened. 
I don't see any of his prints. Only a, a raccoon. This is the way I'm going. Yeah. A duck. Up there. See the trail? Leave that. Oh, really? It's just. Oh, like the first hundred yards. <laughs> it's my. It's only my left hand, so that's all that matters. This is where they're walking. You went out there, and then the bank got so steep that you stuck in the water. I think that's a consequences. Garrett Richardson was swiftly taken to a waiting ambulance where he received immediate treatment before being transported to United General Hospital for further care. Following his release from the hospital, Richardson was escorted to the Skagit County Jail where he was officially booked on an investigative hold for two counts of assault to eluding and resisting arrest. Well, this man is on a whole other level. The confidence he's showing might be something you won't see anywhere else. On February 6, 2023, Arizona police on State Route 89A stopped a reckless driver whose vehicle was dragging a gas pump hose. The driver initially claimed to be a Navy SEAL, but was later identified as 59-year-old Darren Runyon. Despite his denial of having weapons, officers found a 10-inch Bowie knife in the car. During the investigation, Runyon also attacked the officers by punching and biting them while resisting arrest. What are you asking me? Let's get belly. Calm down. Let's get I took the wrong turn. Okay, give me roll your back window down for me. What? Roll down your back window for me. Back window? Yeah. I Shut have to get this dog. I'm maybe still I gotta get this dog to press get belly. Okay, roll down your back window for me. Which one? This one right here. Where are you coming from? Phoenix. Okay. Can you shut your car off, please, sir? Sure. Can you step out for me? Sure. Got any weapons on you? No. Nope. No? Okay. Keep your hands out of your pockets. Where's your ID at? In my, in my driver's license right there, in my wallet. In your wallet? Yeah. Where's your wallet at? Right in the front. My credit card got in today. Okay. I got jumped at my house. I got hit with a shotgun. I got to get the dog to press it. Five, two, four, we're out. Four, Seriously, four, look at my nose. Throughout the conversation, the suspect repeatedly stated that he was a Navy SEAL. However, the situation became more intense as the officers proceeded with the investigation. Check it out. Okay, do uh, you mind if I go in your car and get your wallet for you? I can get it. What, what's the big deal? I'll get to that. I just need your wallet. What's up? No, you tell me. Well, we... I. All I did was ask you. Mm -hmm. I, I'm lost. You want to know what's wrong? What? You just asked me, so I'm about to tell you, okay? You gotta let me talk, though. All we right. heard you. There was a call coming in from Prescott Valley that you were tailgating, going approximately 80 miles an hour down no, the No, no. Uh, this car doesn't do 80. I got jumped at home. I'm a Navy SEAL. I gotta get this dog here. I had to take an auxiliary car. You're a Navy SEAL? Yeah. Where are you stationed at? Down in San Diego Harbor. San Diego Harbor? Yeah. Okay. And I'm lost. I asked you for directions. I got to get this dog here. Well, I ran out of gas. Okay. I gave these kids my, my very good knife for, so somebody to get it. I don't know where I'm at. Granite's Basin. It said Prescott how long ago? You came from Prescott Valley. You're headed towards Prescott now. Where's Prescott? Which way? Prescott's that way. Thank you, sir. Appreciate it. Yeah, you're welcome. I'll tell my commander. No, sir. Uh, yeah, don't get back in your vehicle yet. I need to. Uh, I need you to grab your ID. Okay. Yeah. What's up? Are there any weapons in the car? Nope. When the officers asked Darren for his driver's license, he calmly went to his car to get it. He made sure to let him know that he didn't have any weapons. This is a tactic called compliance and communication. It means following what the officers ask and talking to them politely. Darren did this to make the situation less tense and to show the officers he wasn't a threat. I got jumped at home bad. Hit with a shotgun. I'm Hey, step Tell out them for them. me. Step out. What? No, this way. Come step on. out. You told me there's no weapons in the car. There's one right beneath uh, your seat. There's a big knife this right there. A, I'm a Navy SEAL. Is that a, a weapon? However, the officer soon noticed a 10-inch Bowie knife beneath the driver's seat when he came closer with his flashlight. It's not a weapon. That is What's a weapon. The, I, what is the deal? I'm trying to get to Prescott Valley. I'm a Navy SEAL. I ran out of gas and I got jumped. Okay. 
Come back to my patrol car. And oh, come on, this is ridiculous. No, it's not wait ridiculous. Till you, wait till you hear from my commander. I will. All right. Okay. I want you to call down to, to, to the Phoenix. Come here. Come against no, my bumper. No, you call down to Phoenix. I'm not calling down to Phoenix. Get over here. What? Now. Back my, right there on my bumper. All right. Okay. Where's your wallet? Is it in your front seat? It's, it's right in my front seat. I can had I, a ticket of jewelry. Can car. I go get it? No, I'll get it. No? No, this is ridiculous. It's, it's, what the Stop. Wait, wait, I asked you listen, for simple okay, listen, directions. Listen, listen, listen. You got called in as a possible DUI driver. You're going 80 miles an hour on the I freeway. Did not, I did a, not get jumped. Do not interrupt me again, okay? You had a gas hose connected to your car, which you lost somewhere on the I highway. don't have a your gas hose. Your gas cap is off. You got beers in the passenger just, seat. So you relax and you listen to us, okay? I think kid filled the tank. I thought he was relax. done. Relax. You relax. Talk to us normal because we're talking to you normal. Now right. you're yelling at us, which is causing us to yell at you. I don't mean to. Relax. We're trying I'm to figure relaxed. out what's going on. I was filling up with gas back then. The kid filled yelling. it up. Stop yelling. I'm very angry. We're angry now too because you're not listening very well. What? What the hell is this? You guys are trying to jump me or something? No, we're not trying to jump. I got to get this dog, which is from Israel, for a piece street of the goddamn Prescott. Okay. I do. I guess I give the kid my beers good. The the passenger seat. Yeah, it's supposed to be there, young man. Oh, okay. Why is it supposed to be there? It's ordinance of the navy. Ordinance of the navy. It is. Front beers and there. I'm in telling you, I gave the kid my very best knife because I ran out of gas because I didn't know what was that. He was filling up the tank. I guess he he, he didn't fill it up. I don't know what he did. He said go back to the gas station. Okay. I gotta get this stuck. Is Prescott Valley that way? No. Which way is Prescott? Prescott or Prescott Valley? Uh, Prescott. Prescott. Prescott Valley is that way. Or, sorry, Prescott Valley is where you came from. Right, You're Prescott. You're headed to Prescott. I gotta make my hotel reservations that are already made. The situation had remained relatively calm up to this point, with neither side resorting to significant force or showing signs of escalating tension. However, the suspect's sudden actions changed the dynamic entirely, compelling the officers to swiftly reassess their approach and take decisive action to maintain control of the situation. I appreciate it. I really do. Be good. You're not going anywhere. Be good, man. No. no. What the? What are you? Get there. Get there. Get there. I gotta get the dog there. Help! 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 Hey. Help! You just made things way worse for yourself by assaulting your officers. I didn't. He punched me first. That's absolutely incorrect. Help! Help! No. No, I'm just gonna get there, man. Put your arm behind your Give back. Give me your arm. What's up, man? No, man, I got with the dogs. I got his head. God damn you! Put your arm behind your back now. Keep your arm man. God damn, they're gonna kill you. They're gonna kill you. Son of a bitch. Hey, don't fight me. Son of a bitch. You fight me. You fight me. Do not fight me. You know, you realize you just committed a felony, right? The car's no, getting towed because you decided to commit a felony. He's from Israel, you goddamn son of a bitch. Help! From the Navy SEAL! These guys are f***ing me! Help! 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 I didn't try to get away! Then you pumped all the gas! What the hell's the problem here? Hey, stop. What the hell's the problem? The, the problem is you just assaulted a police officer. You took it from you something grab... that could have been pretty simple up to I a know, felony. No, you grabbed me by the throat. No, you punched our officer no, first you and then me you by ended the up. Throat. Okay. You keep on saying that. Relax. I just don't like Navy SEALs. We were here to make sure you were okay to drive. I am. And you decided to assault a police officer. No, he for no grabbed reason. me by the throat. I want to get my license. He just grabbed me by the He throat. didn't grab you until you punched him in the chest. No, I didn't punch him in the chest. I tried to push him back. You see he grabbed me by his throat. You see that? What? That's a video camera. It recorded right, we'll the whole see. thing. We'll see. <laughs> All right. Let's get you stood up here. Got anything on you? Any drugs? No, no, no? I don't drugs. I'm a seal. Okay. What's, what's, how's my face? How's your face? I got jumped back so I got, I'm trying to get this dog to Prescott. You got to uh, have a seat here, sir. You good? Yeah.
Darren Runyon was ultimately apprehended and charged with aggravated assault on a police officer, resisting arrest, and misconduct involving weapons. Just like Darren, there's someone else who got so tough that a bunch of officers were needed to control him. On May 8, 2022, in Little Rock, Arkansas, a dramatic incident occurred involving Arkansas man Dustin Arch Black and the police. Cameras recorded everything, showing a chaotic scene. It all began when Officer Joshua Blazingame approached Black, but things quickly turned into a struggle as officers tried to arrest him. In the midst of the chaos, Black shouted, Jesus Christ is our Lord and Savior, as he fought against being arrested. Sadly, during the struggle, one officer got bitten, another was hit with a police baton, and one accidentally tased himself. Imagine the challenges officers face when dealing with individuals like Black. How can I help you? Yeah. Doing good? How can I help you? My name. You okay. My name I mean, yeah. What, what can I do for you? It's all like I put my thumb out and you didn't pull over. Okay. What can I do for you? Are you okay? Solid, man. Okay. Yeah. What's, what can I do for you, man? Just wanted to chat. I put my thumb out. You didn't respond. So. Oh, man, I can't stop in the middle of traffic. I pulled over. I mean, I'm here right now. I mean, it's not really traffic. You know okay. I mean? Well, I can't park in the middle of the street. I mean, it's not necessary. I understand. What can I do for you? You got ID with you, my man? I'm solid. I don't need anything. Okay. What, what you doing out here, my friend? Walking. Okay. Well, was that you that moved the cones over there? No. You sure? Because I was told you did. Why don't you have a seat over here? Let's talk, man. If you don't mind, let's have a seat. I need to see some ID, sir. Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Turn around. Turn around. Don't do that. Turn, turn around. Do not do this. Bro, do not do this. You turn don't around. Do this. You turn around. You turn don't the f around. You don't want to do this, bro. Turn around. Turn around. Stop resisting. You don't want to do this. Can you give me another unit? Brentwood, North McKinley, stop. Stop. Stop! When the officer tried talking to Black, things didn't seem right. Black seemed unsure and didn't really answer properly. Then, when the officer tried to stop him, Black fought back, making the situation worse. The officer had to use force, like a taser, to control him and put handcuffs on him. But it didn't stop there. Another officer who came to help accidentally got tased, too. Just let me go out filling the bed. No. You're under arrest right now. Yes, sir. Put your hands behind your back. Yes, sir. Stop. Stop. Taser, Todd. Get on the ground. Taser now. I'm trying to get the taser. Todd, hit you again. Ah. I shot my Get the off of me. Josh. Josh, get on the get on the radio. Right call for the broke. Give me your handcuffs right now. Under arrest. I didn't. Josh, put your handcuffs on. I'm trying to get your hands. Here, 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 here. Let me go. Big old boy, didn't you? Stop. Why are y'all hurting me? Why are y'all hurting me? You're told. Stop. 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 You're hurting me. Stop. Help me. Stop. Help. Stop. Help me. Stop. We are trying to help you. Man. Stop. Help me. Help. Stop. Sir, help me. No. I didn't do anything wrong. Josh, get on the radio. I did call not. For help. We got it on the way. We got it on the way. Well, just after putting handcuffs on him, it became clear that more officers were needed to control this man. Soon, more officers arrived at the scene, and together they managed to restrain him and tie his legs. Throughout the situation, he remained uncooperative. Okay. I know who you are. No, we just. No. No. We need multiple people hold him down. Thank you. Okay. We just need. I need to get off of him. Let's get more help because we're tired. Oh my God, help me. Oh, this woman. Josh, you get your stuff back. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. No, 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 we need to at least two more subjects and medical respond. Get him off my head. Calm down. I can't hear Jesus. No, calm down. Jesus. Calm down. Help me, I'll die. 
Calm down. Well done. Hey. Calm down. You get it to me. Calm down. Stop. Calm down, dude. Calm down. If you get up here from there. Yeah. You okay? Go with my my Tahoe, and in the door panel there's some leg shackles. They're long leg shackles. They may be in the passenger side door. Quit. Just. You guys will get his legs. We're just fired fighting. Y'all got him? Yeah, we got him. Y'all ready to flip him over? All right. Go ahead, flip him over. And finally, after the arrival of more officers, they were able to control him and put him in the vehicle. And now, he will face the consequences of his actions. Well, imagine this. A whole bunch of cops all trying to control just one man. No, we're not God, Jesus, Jesus, Jesus. They're gonna kill me. They're gonna kill me. Put your arm under your front, around your back. I got you. Help me, bro. Put your arm behind your back. I can't. Yes, you can. Help. Jesus loves me. I was walking. He's looking to kill me. We need a car with a cage. Car with a cage. Right here, right here, right here. Let go of the cup. Where's Josh? I'm right here, right here, right here, right here. I'm front of you. Tell me. Hey, tell me I'm gonna tell me, bro. Tell me. Be quiet. Help me. Shut your mouth. Help me. Hey, look Help at me, me, man. Stop. I didn't do anything wrong. They said we got somebody over the cage? Yeah. Right here, right here, right here, right here, right here, right here, man. Right behind you, man. You got shackles on. Get up to your feet. George Floyd style, bro. Be quiet. In the end, Dustin Arch Black is currently being held at the Pulaski County Jail on multiple charges. These include two counts of battery in the first degree, along with charges of disorderly conduct and refusal to submit to arrest. His bond has been set at $15,000.